little bit of heresy I brought computers. Um, this little green thing is called One Laptop Per Child, and um, you can get these uh, once a year through Amazon. You, you have to buy two of them because you end up donating one of them to some, some third world person. They're supposed to be $100, but you end up spending like $400 for two of them. <laughs> so uh, it comes with TamTam -Tam Sin Lab, and it's uh, modeled after Max MSP. You can have four control um, modules, uh, four oscillators, and four uh, modifiers. That's the limit of it. So about as much as you can get into one of those cases there. And, uh, can I jack in? Yeah, you, there's, a, there's a cord right there. OK. You want it to plug right into the amp. Oh. Straight in the amp. OK, this yeah. is dangerous. Oh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> and so uh, the keyboard's actually set up. Like, um, this is, that's three buzz oscillators controlled by a low frequency and an ADSR. And this other patch is kind of a, I thought it was kind of spooky. ADSRs, and uh, but just think, there's many kids around the world who have one of these that are, um, have the ability to put together patches. I think it's pretty cool. So that that's, that software comes with it. Comes with it. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. it, has, it has some. It has a sequencer application. It's temp, uh, you know, like any of the MIDI sequencer things where you poke the notes in. And, has a jam application where it'll throw a random dice and kind of make different rhythms. Hmm. But uh, I brought this because the modules are sin, and since that's what this is, right? And then for spooky sounds, um, Solid State Logic has a free VST. If you go on their website and register, it's called Exorcism. So you go and get this tonight, hook it up to your whatever can drive a VST, and uh, scare the hell out of it. Spooky sounds. Uh, they took some. Um, on, let me kill this thing. So they have some. Uh, 